Welcome back everyone. In this video we are going to take a look at edit mode and introduce you to the most basic things you can do in edit mode in Blender. Now normally when you have an object selected like this we're in object mode right now but if you're not happy with your basic shapes like the cubes and the cylinders and the cones and you need more you need to edit them and make them look differently build upon them and change them. This is what edit mode is all about. To get into edit mode you just go here and select edit mode and then you can always go back to object mode or you can hit the tab key the tab key much faster just goes in and out of edit mode so I'm gonna stay in edit mode there and when I'm in edit mode how do we start to do some basic edits well you have to decide what you want to edit do you want to edit the points which are called vertices okay the corners do you want to do edges which are these here or do you want to do the faces, which are these things, the faces of the object, right? So what I'm going to do for this one is I'm going to select Edge Select. I'm going to right-click select that edge, and I'm just going to use the Move Handle. I can move that edge out. I can also go to this side, right-click, move that edge out. Now you'll notice if I'm actually using a view like Quad View, so let's say View, Quad View, it's actually a little bit easier to do. I can actually select the edges that I want to work with and you can see exactly you know how much or how many units you're moving everything it may make it a bit easier for you in the long run. So don't forget about your quad view uh, to make things a little more simple. For this video, control out Q, I'm just going to stick in this view, right? Because I want to quickly show you how to do some of this stuff. So there's my edge and some editing I've done to my edge. Here's what else you can do though. Let me go to face select. Let me right click and select the top face. I can move it okay, in any direction. But what I can also do is I can still do what I used to do before when I have objects selected. I can scale and I can rotate. So if I hit the S key, S, I'm doing a general scale. So I can shrink that face down. Right? So you can see how that's sort of how you get a pyramid or close to it. Or open up something. You can even hit R and rotate. Although that does weird uh, shapes, it is there and it is an option. When you hit S to scale, S, you can still follow it up with an X, Y, or Z. So I'll follow up with a Y. I hit Y there. Now I'm just scaling in the Y direction. All right, so you have a little more control over how you want to do things. Okay, this is the basics of edit mode, and don't forget you can do vertices too. So if I want to move vertices out, you know, I can move them out, you start to get weird shapes. Now, that was starting with a cube. What I can do is I can also do the same thing, just showing you with another shape or two. I'll show you with a cylinder. So I'm going to hit the tab key, get out of edit mode, back to object mode. Now I'm just actually going to delete this. I'll hit the delete key. I'm going to add myself a cylinder here. So there's a nice little cylinder. For this one, I'm going to go to quad view, control alt Q. And let's hit the tab key. Brings me into edit mode. And I'm going to select some vertices. So I'm going to select that one right there. So vertices select. And I'm going to select that one right there. And in this view, you can see I've grabbed the top one. I actually want the bottom one. So let's right-click that bottom one. And just sort of show you, if I want to move it out, I use quad view, move it out. I'm going to go around to the other side. I'm going to grab that one. And I'll move that one out about a unit. So you can see how you can start getting the shape sort of looking neat. And if I want, I can now switch into Face Select, hit S to scale, shrink that down, and you can see it's sort of the start of a plane, not quite. Uh, but this gives you an idea how you start with basic shapes and start to modify them. Now there's a lot to learn in edit mode. We're going to give you a handful of things you can do, you know, to give you a good start so you can make quite a wide variety of different objects but that's a good little intro now what you need to do is you need to go practice a few little edits using just these simple tricks right 
Remember, you move vertices, edges, and faces, or you scale them and you rotate them.